Oh, yes, yeah, certainly. Uh, the, the compassion or the, uh, some sense of concern of others' well-being, there are two types or two levels. One, I think mainly biological factor. Uh, so that, without training, simply biological factor, like mother shows a uh, sense of concern about their uh, or say the youngster, their children. Not only human beings, but it, animals, birds also. Except you some birds, uh, some animal may be different. But otherwise, basically, I think all mammals uh, have that kind of sort of what's it, feeling because of biological. Mainly, the youngster's life, survival, entirely depend on mother's care or someone else's care. So because of that reality, the emotionally, some kind of close feeling, sense of concern of their well-being. That's biological factor. Now that take as a seed, then use human intelligence, the how much sort of valuable thing about that warm-heartedness. Uh, uh, so knowing that, then extend uh, not only your sort of friends or your sort of uh, close friends or relatives, but also the rest of the uh, sort of sentient being, or at least the human being, including your enemy. Now here, the biological factor, sort of compassion, is biased, limited. Only your relatives, close friend. Because that biological factor of compassion uh, mainly oriented others' attitude. So that kind of compassion cannot extend towards your enemy because they create trouble for you. But now, uh, through training, through awareness, you see this awareness sort of what's the long-term benefit, uh, sort of larger sort of what's the yes, uh, because of the interest. Then, through awareness, through familiarize, that's through, that means training. So, uh, through that way, you can develop genuine sense of concern of well-being other, including your enemy. As far as their attitude is concerned, they are enemy. Uh, they, they create trouble for you. But still, there are, for example, in human case, still there are human beings. They also have the right to overcome suffering. So there's sufficient reason to develop a sense of concern of their problem, their suffering. So that's the second level. So that kind of compassion, uh, unbiased, unlimited, that needs training, awareness.